Welcome, today we'll be viewing the Victoria by Bearway. So this house is located in Irvine at Montgomery Park and you can see all the prices and plots available on their website by clicking on the link in the description bar below. The Victoria is a stunning house. It is a four bedroom property and the master bedroom has got an ensuite. It also has an integrated garage, a front facing living room and an open plan kitchen slash dining space, which also features the French doors as well. So stepping into the house, you have a decent uh, spacious hallway. Then you have your downstairs WC. I love the way they've decorated this space. Um, the towels are lovely. I, they, I think I've mentioned this before, Bellway love mirrors. So they tend to utilize mirrors in a lot of their bathrooms. So you've got your sink and your toilet in here as well. Back out into the hallway, we're now going to step into the lounge. very spacious instead of the conventional setup we're opting for more conversational arrangement pulling furniture away from the walls creating a cozy and inviting atmosphere lighting can create a cozy ambience we're swapping away the old fixtures for something more modern and statement making so we've got all the spotlights living rooms are for living right let's maximize functionality check out this coffee table um here which is lovely and also the tv unit with so many cabinets accessories can make or break a space we're adding through pillows rugs and artwork to inject personality one tip that i can give to people looking to purchase a property whether old or new textures and patterns for visual interest without overwhelming the room is very important as you can see in here and um, this is not just a basic living space they've utilized the room by adding artwork uh, lighting different furniture different colors which is lovely they've even got plants in here as well Yes, it, this can also feel a little bit overwhelming. You don't need to have every single artwork or uh, plant in here or throw on cushion, but you can add a little bit of something just to give the room character. Stepping into the kitchen slash lounge, beautiful design. The design, um, the kitchen design of the Victoria is beautiful. Honestly, I think it's one of the best looking kitchens um, by Bellway. You've got your breakfast bar, which is nice. Then you've got a dining set in here, which sits four people. You've also got your French doors, uh, which you can use to access your back garden. I know this is a show home, but I'll just quickly show you the back garden. It's very big really really spacious but one thing to note is you will probably need to do your own turf at the back of your garden you've got your wine cooler that's not standard you also get a cooker and an extractor fan as well this type of uh, gas cooker would be an upgrade you also get your double oven as standard you also get an integrated fridge freezer you've got your sink here the worktops are an upgrade so you can request for this type of worktop if you want to but it will cost you extra then you have this lovely spacious window by the sink giving you the view to your garden Victoria also comes with a utility room which will also come with a sink as well as you can see in the show home you've got your sink you've got your integrated um, 
wash it and dry it as well you also have your door to access your back garden something that's also nice about the victoria even though it's locked in this particular show home it comes with a spare room which you can utilize you can use it as a pantry or you can use it for storage apologies but it was locked so i couldn't access it to show you guys the size of it so yeah so that was the downstairs hope you enjoyed um the downstairs tour we're now headed upstairs to the four bedrooms and the family bathroom so these clear doors just to mention as well uh, they are not standard they are an upgrade so if you want these kind of doors you'll need to pay extra for them so just giving you guys another final look at the living room so we're now headed upstairs i love the landing um, of the Victoria house type I think it's just absolutely stunning so spacious gives you an amazing view of the downstairs and the staircase um, I love also the wood as well I like the contrast between the white and the the natural wood color as well so very lovely so going into the first bedroom this is a double room lovely I love the colors in here they've got the uh, the greys, uh, blues and whites so very lovely uh, you've also got a nice view of your back garden um, look at the lovely snow just making it look so so lovely um, but yeah so it's a nice double room very spacious um, you can use this as an office or as well as an option if maybe uh, you don't need it as a bedroom so it's a very lovely lovely option lovely artwork as well to keep you motivated so back out into the hallway so directly in front of us is another bedroom so this is another um, double room very simple the decorations in here are simple you have the fitted wardrobes in here I don't think they come as standard that's probably an upgrade you would need to speak to the builder to find out exactly what comes as standard and also what comes as an upgrade so be sure to contact them to find out more information but the room itself is very spacious very lovely and um, again if you don't need it as a bedroom you can utilize the space you can even make it into a family tv room or something or just as an office uh, whatever you prefer right across is the family bathroom you've got a very lovely large bathtub half height tiles I love the chrome finish it's very clean I love the tiles in here I love the colors the gray and the white Um, the finish is just stunning it just makes it very clean you know that clean look <laughs> very lovely then you've got your toilet and just right across from that is your sink as well you've got your mirrors as well not going to mention it again <laughs> but yeah you've got your mirrors again in your bathroom upstairs as well and another good thing about the victoria is you have plenty of storage so upstairs you also have this extra little room that you can use for storing stuff and don't forget you also have a garage so plenty plenty of space plenty of storage and look how big this space is really lovely i love the lighting as well looks lovely and i like the use of of the mirror at the back there um, i think that would create a good illusion of uh, of the space being bigger than it is um, now heading into um, the final bedroom well not final third bedroom my apologies oh wow stunning absolutely stunning I love 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 this room I love the way they've they've decorated this particular room and um, they've got the two single beds so if you've got uh, kids they can share this room which is lovely And I think you can fit a double bed in here as well though they don't have fitted wardrobes but 
you can add that as an option if you wanted to but i think i like the way they've decorated it it's quite nice and at least if two boys are sharing or two girls are sharing this room um it would be nice and they can be together how lovely are these doors these are definitely an upgrade wow the master bedroom stunning i love it i like the gray finish you've got your fitted wardrobes again they've utilized the mirror giving the illusion of an even bigger room even though the room is big but the mirrors just makes it look even bigger i like the the ceiling height um curtains very lovely i like the gray walls i'm not a big usually i'm not a fan of gray walls but the way they've done it in this house it's beautiful stunning it doesn't look lifeless um it's done to a very good uh test and standard then you've got your own suite you've got your toilet your sink and your shower as well i like the tiles in here very bright um, my only uh, comment about this ensuite is it's not big. It's not the biggest. Obviously, it's usable. It's fine. But I think uh, I wish it could be bigger. I think that would be really nice. So, yeah. So, that's the full tour of this beautiful house. If you enjoyed this uh, house tour, make sure to subscribe. Leave us a comment. Let us know uh, what other house type you would like to see on our channel. And if you own a property or are a property builder and you would like us to feature a house on our channel, make sure to send us an email. Uh, we'll, we'll get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in our next video. Bye. Thank you.